very good morning to Miss Pat and my fellow friend. I am Izati. I'm the first presenter of my group and today I will share about the body composition. What is body composition? Body composition is a testing to determine how much of our body fat. Besides that, it also the body composition also the method of describing what the body made of. This is include fat, protein, mineral, and the body water. Body composition also is an analysis that accurately show changes in fat mass, muscle mass, and body fat percentage. There are several type of body composition tests. First, body mass index BMI. Second, the scale pole measurement. These two tests are very common in our daily life. And the other test for body composition is whole body platymography, both both underwater or hydrostatic method. And the last one is the scan. And in this presentation, I would like to share about the body mass index, which is BMI. BMI is a way of describing height and weight in one number that can help the if someone weight is healthy. The target population of BMI is general population. This is because BMI are often used as generation, general population measure to determine the level of health risk association associated with obesity. There are three procedures that we need to follow for the BMI, which is measure your weight, measure your height, and calculate BMI. How to call it out, how to calculate our BMI, which is using math formula, which is BMI formula, that which is BMI equal to M, where the M is body mass in kg, divided by H power of 2, which is H is the height in meter. The higher the score, usually indicating higher level of body fat, which is mean the higher the BMI, the more fat in our body. There are equipment for BMI test, which is for sure, wet scale and the high scale. We also can found BMI calculator in online. And the most important thing is in BMI test is body mass index chart. Um, there, are, there are four categories in the chart, which is underweight, normal, overweight, and obese. The category are shown that how healthy is our body and how many is our fat in our body. Uh, advantages and disadvantages of the BMI, which is the for the advantages. BMI is the only simple calculation I receive from standard height and weight measurement. BMI also is the cheapest test in body composition because we can find easily um, the equipment which is weight scale and body scale. And the lastly for the advantages is BMI are suitable for large scale study. While the disadvantages for BMI is certain population BMI can be inaccurate as a measure body fatness. Obese individuals tend to underestimate weight, while the shorter individuals tend to overestimate their height when self-reported. For example, large and muscular tough athletes may score high BMI, which is incorrectly read them as a obese. As we know, athletes they are have more muscle than the ordinary people. Um, the video show how 
us to record the data of PNI. Okay, that's all for me for the BNI, and I would like to pass the presentation to my friend Azur. Thank you. Thank you, my friends Izati. Hello, Miss. My name is Muhammad Azrul Hafizam bin Awang Abdul Halim. So now I will proceed to the next topics, which is the skin fault measurements. Skin fault measurement is a technique how much fat on body, and also involving using the device called a caliper to lightly pinch the skin and underlying fat on several places. There are some types of skin caliper. So, this is the two example of skin caliper. As you guys can see, at the right side the familiar and at the left the skin caliper easy to you because the equipment easy to find and easy to use. Next slides, I will explain about the norms for men and women. As you guys can see, the blue column is a land, the green column is a ideal, the yellow is a average, and the red column is a above ever average. For for your information, guys, the the norms is men and women is a very same, but the difference is the uh, point at the at the egg range because the norms follow the egg range egg range after that i will proceed to the next slide which is the skin fault measurement procedure you need to firmly grab a, a full of your clients skins between your thumbs and index finger Lift this up. The skin fault needs to thick thickness. The first one is a uh, one of skins. The second is one of the subcutaneous fat knot, muscle, and fascia. Place the conduct surface of the caliper at 90 degrees angles to the skin fold approximately 1 cm below finger. Slowly release the pressure between the finger but remain holding the skin fold so that a greater pressure is applied by caliper. Release the handles. Read the neatly near 0.1 mm approximately 4 seconds after pressure release. The next is tricep skin fault. Ver vertical fault locate, uh, located at posterior midline of upper arm. Measure halfway between a chromium bony points of shoulder and electronic process bony point of elbow arm help freely to the sides of the bony the next is bicep skin fold vertical fold located on the anterior middle of upper arm over the belly of the biceps muscles located 1 cm highly that's the level used to mark the tricep sides. The next is subscapular skin folds. The agonal folds located 1 to 2 cm below the inferior angle of the scapula. The bottoms of the shoulder blade 
if you struggle to locate the bottoms of the shoulder blades, then ask, ask your clients to raise the arms behind their back. This shoulder makes the scapula more prominent. The fault is subsiliac skin fault. The got faults located one cm above the anterior superior iliac crest top to hip bones. Locating these landmarks may recruit you poke firmly, firmly, tight, thick substantial layer of fat to find the bone underneath. Okay, this slide show the advantage and disadvantage for skin faults. Skin fold caliper advantage is simpler the hydrostatics with things and many of the other body compositions techniques. The second is inexpensive and the last uh, provides information on body fat distributions. And this advantage is predictions body fat is depend on specific equations assumptions. Difficult to take measurements in very obvious individuals. Difference and in, in, difference in, in measurements between investigations. This video show how to record skin first measurement for men. Three sides. For male, the first is chest. And your mark X for the chest. The next is triceps. You must hold your arms at 90 degree angle. And then your mark plus. And the last is scap scapula at the back. That's all for males and the next is for female. For female is a uh, three sides times for the men. The first is triceps. You hold your arm in 90 degree angle. In the seconds and abdominal, make sure to cm from the button. And the last is a super iliac. And this is all for men and female and male.
for the conclusions of body compositions is in conclusions body compositions is one of age related fitness meaning that body compositions is very important elements in terms of sport or individual health in addition my by measuring body compositions we can monitor the level of individual bmi such as normal underweight overweight and obesity other than that also can monitor the effectiveness of exercise training programs in athletes that's all from me thank you miss